Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's that time of year again that vloggers seem to love. It's fall. Or more like winter because I'm a disorganised blogger who can't get her videos edited on time. But anyway. I do love me a good full lip colour and I have some that I'm pretty fond of so I thought I'd share them with you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. The first lipstick shade is this rather peculiar looking greyish lilac kind of shade which is never one I would have picked ordinarily but it was actually given to me. This is the only Tom Ford lipstick I own but the formula is absolutely gorgeous. It's really soft and moisturising and it's really pigmented without being too drying. Um, it's quite a difficult shade to wear but I think with quite a simple eye it looks quite kind of edgy and cool. This next one was actually the first lipstick I ever bought. I think I must have been about 16 or 17 and I still remember going to Superdrug to buy it. I've since replaced it so this isn't the exact same tube of lipstick but it's basically a very neutral subtle brown shade. Um, it has got a slight shimmer running through it but nothing too drastic which makes it a great everyday colour. I kind of have a love-hate relationship with this one. It's one of the satin lip pencils from NARS. Basically, I love the shade, not so keen on the formula. It's just not very long-lasting, you have to constantly reapply it. But, like I said, the shade is absolutely gorgeous, so I don't mind having to reapply it a few times. And it does work quite well as a lip stain, so when you don't want that kind of in-your-face, dark red shade but you just want kind of more of a hint of colour this one works quite well if you blot it out. Now when I do want that in your face dark red bold statement lip this is the product I go to every time and it'll only set you back £2.35 on Amazon. W7 Makeup are one of my favourite budget beauty brands and this Butter Kiss lipstick is really, really amazing value. It's super pigmented, very long lasting and very comfortable to wear. This is another product that's quite affordable. Um, the colour looks quite intimidating but it's actually great for every day and actually when you wear it, it's a really pretty colour. It's a very wearable berry shade which is perfect for this kind of year. And I also really love the packaging because it's very easy to reapply on the go. You don't have to worry about sharpening it, you just wind it up and you just pop it in your handbag and you're good to go. Next we have the only lip gloss I'm featuring here and I have to say I never thought lip gloss would make a comeback but here we are. Again, the shade of this one looks quite kind of dark and moody, but don't be fooled. It's got a really pretty gold glitter running through it, which looks absolutely gorgeous when it catches the light. It's perfect for party season. And finally, I've saved what's probably one of my favourite products in my makeup collection for last. It's quite a daring and dramatic shade, so much so that I have to psych myself up when I apply it, as you just saw there. The shade is called Drop Dead Red, and it's by Too Faced. It's from the Melted Matte range, but I love this shade. It's definitely a more daring one. As you can see, it's a very striking maroon burgundy color. It's not for the faint-hearted, but it is so striking and makes such a statement. Um, I just think it completely elevates any look. I will say it's very drying and it's quite an almost harsh formula, but it's kind of expected when you're getting the pigment payoff that you are. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe.